Well, something wonderful happened to me yesterday. Oh, good, while I was suffering. God sent me somebody to yes. help my situation. Yes. You know, I've been in pain all these weeks, mm -hmm. really serious pain. Okay. And I've tried everything. I've done the acupuncture. I've done the PT. I've seen the doctor. I've got the MRI. And yet the pain persists. There was one thing that I had almost forgotten. Years ago, maybe it was 25 years ago, we had just really started this show, and I had a, um, what do you call those things? Um, Heart attack? No. <laughs> so that came a little later. No, I had the, uh, what I'm always saying, you women couldn't stand it. The oh, pain. kidney stone. Kidney stone. Yes, us women, because women kid never get kidney stones. Here. Yeah, right here. down here, you're absolutely right, yeah. And it was so intense that I went to uh, the hospital. Yes. What's the hospital on Park Avenue? Um, Cedars of Lebanon? No, that's no, L.A. That's Cedars. Anyway, so I'm in there, and day after day I'm in pain, and they're yeah. saying they're hoping it comes out, otherwise there's going to have to be an operation. You were doing the show here. I wasn't yes. doing it. I, 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 so yeah, I just was started filming, the show. Somebody was filling in for yeah. you. Yes, okay. Billy Crystal came in. Yeah. Anyway, uh, we had a... Uh, the, President of ABC was a guy who I worked for in L.A. as general manager, John Severino. Okay. Tough Italian guy, you know. Yeah. Every day he'd call, how do you feel? I said, well, Sev, it still hurts. Come on, get out of bed. Come on. He said, you just, you just started the show. you got to come back. Right. So at the end of the week, I learned that if it doesn't come out by Monday, I'm going to have to have an operation, and I'll be in the hospital six weeks. Oh, well, that will scare anything out of you. Severino right. goes nuts. He says, I'm going to come over. I'll take it out myself. You know, you've got to come back. So I'm really nervous over the weekend. And then I remember a guest we had on our show, mm -hmm. reflexologist. Yes. She wrote the book on reflexology, mm -hmm. Laura Norman. And we used her on the show. It was a lot of fun. We were playing games with her, of course. But all of a sudden it occurred to me, let's see if this thing works. Brought her in. She sat on a Sunday night, time running out for Regis to go under the knife. She's sitting <laughs> in the back of the bed. Uh, at the end of the bed and under the covers because I didn't want the hospital to see this woman working on my feet, you know. Right. <laughs> seems, seems very snooty, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, it does. Seems very elitist. And anyway, <laughs> she's doing this and she's pushing and an hour and a half, God bless her, she worked on me. Wow. And of course, everything remained the same. But through the night, you know, you have to go to the bathroom and you have to, you have to do what you're going to do in a cup. You know a cup? Yeah, you know I know a cup. Yeah, yeah I know. Okay. <laughs> it's a tin cup. It's a tin cup. So just in case the it's thing... It's a tin cup? Yeah, so just in case the thing comes out, you can hear it when you pick it up. So... No kidding! So through the night, I go to the bathroom maybe three times, hoping and praying, but I don't hear anything. Go back to bed. In the morning, Jose comes. Jose, the, you know, the hospital, the nurse's Attended. aide. Yeah. Right, okay. Okay, Mr. Philbin, we have to go now. They're waiting for you in the operating room. I said, oh, Jose, please. I go into the bathroom, and I pick up the cup, and I hear click, click. I said, Jose, Jose, listen to this. <laughs> it's the kidney stone. It's no, out. No. Now, just, just by luck, yesterday, this Laura Norman, who's been living in Florida, keeps her place here in New York, but most of the time in Florida, comes back. She knows one of the guys who worked on our CD, and all of a sudden, the guy tells her, Regis is under pain. She calls up, come on over, and I take my first treatment. little work treatment. Okay. And I must, I'm not cured. I'm not cured, because this is a very severe pain. Not that you care. <laughs> but I feel a lot better. Wow. Absolutely. Fantastic. God sent it. God, God yeah. sent her. And she puts these essential oils. She's got a new product. Puts yes. them on the feet that really inspire. You know, it goes right through the whole sure. Gets into the bloodstream. Gets into the bloodstream. Oh. I, I still believe, though, if Gilman had recommended reflexology, you would have told him he was a kook. <laughs> Oh, he's a kook anyway. <laughs> but isn't that wonderful that I, I found this it's... woman again? Not only did she take out this, but one day I remember I had the, uh, not a boil. What did I have on, the, on my neck, Gilman? I don't know. This no, no, I, I had, no, I had a thing here. You're a welcome, goiter. America. You had a goiter? You a goiter. A I goiter. had a goiter. I had a goiter. <laughs> She took care of the goiter. Kids, <laughs> little, kids little... aren't you glad you stayed home from school today? Uh, isn't this so glad she home? came to the, my rescue. Thank God nobody else was coming, I'll tell you that. <laughs>